Hello, everyone. Thank you for stopping by to see me today. I know y'all. I know I haven't done a video since Friday. But y'all, I've been kind of under the weather a little bit and having sinus problems. I don't know if any of you have sinus problems, but you should know how that feels, okay? Sinus infection. Man, I'm telling you. All up in here is jacked up. It's just jacked up. I'm sorry. Yeah, I look kind of awful today. I got plaits on my head. Who know what plaits is back in the day? Did, did only black people say plaits? You know, I know some people call them braids. This is not braids. Braids is like, I guess, when you have the corn rolls, whatever. But I just didn't feel like doing my hair today. I just washed it and plaited up. Y'all know how it is, okay? Some days you look good and some days you don't. But today I'm going to talk about the debate that's coming. It's going to be the second debate that's coming, y'all. And my man, where he at? My man said he ain't coming. I'm not coming to do no debate. I'm not coming. And do you know that the other Republican candidates... They are pissed off because my man said, hell no. Hell no. Y'all ain't getting me on now and try to embarrass me and make me act a fool because basically that's what they want to do. They want him to get on there so they can humiliate him, make him mad because, you know, my man do got a little temple. They want to make him mad so he can explode on them so they can say, see, See, this is what you will be getting right here, okay? A man who cannot answer questions properly, who gets angry because we confront him. This is what they're trying to do, y'all. This is what they're trying to do. Now, if this is your first time here, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Do that for me. Do that for Sun Fake, okay? Because I need all the help I can get over here. And go to TimberlilyCreations.com. I make beautiful mugs over there. Beautiful mugs for you to drink your coffee or tea and to watch me or your favorite movie. All right. And go to cookingwithsandrafay.com. As soon as I get better, I'm going to put some more videos over there. But right now, I can't do it, y'all. My hands are kind of full. Y'all know how that is. All right. Moving right along here. From the hill. Pence. Mike Pence, former vice president under Donald Trump, said, Pence knock, he knocks Trump for skipping second debate. I think that it's a missed opportunity. That's what he said. It's a missed opportunity for us to dog you out. That's really what he's trying to say. It's a missed opportunity because we need you there so we can make you look like a dumb and make you look like a fool. But really and truly, though, y'all, let me tell you something. Trump really ain't got to do those debates. He's number one right now. Now, the only debate that's going to count is when he's running against whoever, you know, for the presidency. Okay? I don't mean to... The, the Republicans like him. I'm talking about when he's running, you know, when they're doing debates for the real president, who's going to be the president. When the Democrats pick who they're going to run and who the Republicans are going to pick, which is going to be Donald Trump. We already know that. And he knows it too. He knows it. So I ain't got to debate y'all, okay? I don't have to humiliate myself because y'all are kind of stupid, a lot of y'all Republicans. Kind of stupid. That's what he's thinking, you know. I know y'all going to be attacking me, you know. Why put yourself in a situation like that? Okay, let me move right along. Let me move right along and tell you what Pence said. It said former Vice President Pence, not former President Trump, for skipping the second GOP primary debate in 2024 presidential cycle in an interview Monday. I think it's a missed opportunity for Donald Trump, and I think it's a missed opportunity for Republican voters. This is what Pence is saying. 
Pence said in an interview Monday on CBS News when asked about Trump's decision not to attend the second debate in the GOP primary. Pence is also running for the GOP nomination in 2024, in which we know he's not going to win, y'all. He's just wasting some money. He's just trying to use money, y'all, to, to for taxes, tax purpose. He probably can write that off, okay? You ain't telling me this man got a chance in hell. You can't tell me he does, okay? A lot of Republicans don't like him, but you know what? He's still staying in the race, okay? He's still there. Also from the Hill, it says, look, this country's in a lot of trouble. This country's in a lot of trouble. Joe Biden has weakened America at home and abroad. And I think the former president, just like all the rest of us, vetting for the Republican nominations, owe it. They owe it to the American people to express what our agenda will be for turning this country around. That's what Pence said. Well, Trump is already out there doing his campaign. Going from city to city, state to state, telling you what he's going to do for you, the American people. Why he got to get on a stage and be humiliated, okay? Because you know what? They want the Democrats to see this also, y'all. Because you know some of them Republicans are rhinos. They're rhinos. They don't want Trump to win. Any means necessary, we got to get this dude out of here. We got to get him out of here, y'all. We can't have this. Even us Republicans, we don't want Trump as the front winner. We don't want him. We don't want him. So he ain't got to do none of that, y'all. He ain't got to go out there and debate, okay? He's debating. He's saying what he's going to do for you, the American people, when he's on television live, okay? When he's on YouTube live. The television really don't want to put him live. Now, I think Newsmax does it. I'm not for sure. I'm not sure about that. But y'all let me know down in the comment section. It said, reporting on Tuesday confirmed that Trump plans to deliver a speech to auto workers in lieu of attending next week's second GOP debate, which will be hosted by Fox Business. See there? He don't need none of that. He don't need to debate them folks. Trump skipped the first Republican debate, explaining his decision at the time by pointing to his commanding lead in the race and suggesting Fox News Channel was hostile to him. So he did not want to boost its rating. He did not want to boost its ratings by going over there because you know what? Trump is the one that they want to see. You think they want to see Mike Pence and all them other people that's running? Do you think they really want to see that? Do you think so? Put it down there in the comments. Hey, y'all want to know. But Trump said, no, y'all not going to get no ratings from me. Y'all not going to get a lot of money and advertisements from me being on your channel because y'all dog me out, okay? I'm not stupid. I'm not going on. I'm not going to make you no money. And I can't blame them. They dogged him out really bad, y'all. They did. Now, I want y'all to tell me, do you think Trump should debate the other Republicans? When y'all already know what he's about and what he stands for and what he plans on to do, okay? He said he's going to stop that border, okay? He's going to stop, stop the illegals from coming in, taking over. You see how New York and Chicago is having a hissy fit? He's going to stop that. He's going to stop all the stuff that Biden undead. He's going to start back fracking fossil fuel, which they don't want. You know, the clean energy people, they don't want none of that stuff. Even though it's cheaper for our economy, for our cars to run and gas and stuff like that. Even though, now I heard, I don't know, y'all let me know down in the comment section. Even though, you know, cars be on the road every day, planes be up in the sky and stuff like that. Trains going by, you know, buses going by. All these years, hundreds and hundreds of years, ever since car was created, even now, do you actually think the ozone is messed up and it's going to kill us in a couple of years, 10, 20 years from now? 
You know, they protesting. They having all these protests in New York City. A lot of people got arrested. Hundreds of people. There was thousands of people down there, but a hundred of people got arrested. Do you really think? Now, I heard. Now, let me just say this. Allegedly, now, I heard that it's not messing up the ozone. They doing this for a reason. And I'm trying to figure out what the reason is. Y'all can put it down in the comment section for me because I have no earthly idea why they're trying to do this. I don't know anything about the ozone. I don't see anything in the skies that's going wrong. I don't see anything. Now, I'm not saying that all this stuff is not bad for you. All the gasoline and stuff like that. But I think as long as you're not sitting up there sniffing it, Sitting in traffic for hours and hours, smelling the films, I think you're going to be okay. I think you're going to be all right. Okay. Now, like I said, go down that comment section. Tell me what you think about this whole thing. Does Mike Pence have a point? Does Trump need to take himself over there and let the people dog him out? Does he? He should just take it like a man. Should he? Show the people what, who you are. They already know who he is. They already know his temperament. They already know. Why well, got to show us again? Why? They want to be able to dog him out, y'all. Well, I know y'all keep saying, stop the stop saying dog, and I can't help it because that's what it is. They want to put their foot on his neck. That's what they want to do. But my man is smart. He's like, no, y'all ain't doing that to me. Y'all not going to do that to me. I'm not going to put myself up there and let people do this to me because, you know, I have some common sense. The people already know who I am, and I don't have to prove myself to y'all. When it comes to the main debate, then y'all going to see and know who I really am. And with all that said, y'all, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. And watch the next video coming up. Thank you.